when you get to me, when you get to, my, to the father, let me go to me. The son. How do you interpret? You gotta, you gotta worship the son to get to the father. He's the mediator. In First Timothy two and five, they say that the Messiah is the mediator. He's the mediator between the Most High and the Israelite. So at this point, you're saying that in order for me to be able to get a relationship to the Most High, the middle man, you gotta go through the Messiah. He is the, he is, he's called, give me 1 Timothy 2 and 5. 1 Timothy. Timothy 2 and 5. For there is one God and one mediator between God and men, the man, Christ Jesus. Right. You got to go through the Messiah to get to the Father. So, so absent of uh, worshiping Jesus, your connection to God can't be, what would that be without? Well, we connected through the Most High, through his Son. But to tell you in uh, Colossians 1, that he made him heir over everything. The Messiah was the one that created the earth, the angels, all that. The Most High made his son, his son made the angels, and the Messiah and the angels made the earth and everything in it. He's the heir of everything. So the Messiah is not referenced in Genesis. Yeah, he's yes. in Genesis, <laughs> Genesis 49. The very, like, in the creation story, Jesus is a reference as the creator God. When you when you read when they say Genesis one when they say in the beginning God made the heavens and the earth that word God is Allah Hayyim in the Hebrew Allah Hayyim means judges angels rulers so that was the Messiah and the angels creating the earth that wasn't the Most High the Most High didn't come in to the second chapter in Genesis when you see Lord L O R D in all caps that's the Most High the word God means which the Muslims say God which is Allah. But the word God is Allah Hayyim. Right. It's a plural word, meaning angels, right. judges, gods. The Lord says, I saw 82 that we gods, but we shut down like men. Because he put us, the Israelites, in mortal flesh. So we have to suffer like the heathens on this sign. From 2 down to 18, the Lord made us like these heathens. The chapter, the Japanese, the Chinese, the so called white man. We ain't mortal, we we immortal. Right. But because we sin against the Lord, he put us in mortal flesh. We die like men. We're gonna die like men. Right. These are the chains of darkness in 2 Peter 2 and 4. We the, we the fallen angels, the men. That's us, the nation of Israel, 12 tribes of Israel, the men. I get you on this, brother? You got it. Daughter. This is John chapter 14 and 6. Yep. Yahweh Shai said unto him, right. I am the way, right. the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. The Most High, the Heavenly Father, whose name is Yahweh, in Hebrew, he gave his son authority over everything. So if you don't worship the son, you can't worship the Father. Because we dirty, we filthy. You can't, when, when the Most High told Moses, the Israelites said, we want to see, we want to see Yahweh. He said, well, tell them, watch their clothes for three days, don't come near their wives, and I'm, I'm going I'm to pull up on them. But then when they heard it, they were terrified. Right. We can't go to the Lord because we dirty. That's it. So through the Messiah, that's why he became the sacrificial lamb. He took all the sins of the nation of Israel on him. We can't get to the Lord without the, without the Son. I got one. You got it. First Timothy chapter 2 and verse 5. Beautiful. For there is one God <laughs> and one mediator <laughs> between Yahweh Bashim Shai and men, yep. the man for Mashiach Yahweh Shai. Right. Yahweh Shai the Hebrew name. Who the word and call Jesus. But yeah. I got a quick one too. Go, Go ahead. ahead. This is um Spirit, man. Jeremiah chapter 15, verse 1. It says, Then said the Lord yep. unto me, yep. though Moses and Samuel stood before me, yep. yet my eye could not be towards this people. Right. Cast them out of my sight and let them go forth. See, because they they feel they dirty. And two-thirds of our people don't want to return to the Lord. Because you gotta worship the you gotta worship the sun. It's a the truth. Right. You gotta worship the sun in truth. That's how you get back to the Father. Right. Yeah, you gotta worship the Son. The Lord said He made Him heir. He's over everything. Of all things. But go ahead. You got one more thing. Psalm chapter two and twelve. Kiss the Son. Right. Lest He be angry. Mm -hmm. this. Go ahead. And ye perish from the way. Right. When his wrath is kindled, but a little. And his wrath is kindled. Right. That's why he said in Revelation 1, those that pierced him are going to mm -hmm. see him when he returns. Mm -hmm. The same one that pierced him during the Roman him, they're going to be here in reincarnation to see him when he returns. They tell you when Isaiah 63, 
is the vengeance burn up in his heart, heart. to return right, to yeah. destroy the same ones that pierced him, which was the so-called white man, the Romans, the Edomites. But yeah, brother. Appreciate you. Yes, sir. Hey, hey, on YouTube. Yeah. Salawam. Salawam. Just in case you want to be on YouTube, our channel is GMS Orlando. GMS. Orlando. We out here every Saturday. All right, All right brother. All right. I got one, brother. Go ahead. That's good. That's up. This is 1 Corinthians chapter 15 and 45. And so it is written, the first man, Adam, was made a living soul. Right. The last Adam yep. was made a quickening spirit. spirit. Mm. That's what Yahweh shot done to us, man. It goes uh, uh, Isaiah 11.